Hello learners. Now let us see how to prove that sin square a by two plus sin square b by two minus sin square c by two is equal to this. But is given that a, b, c are angles of a triangle. Now, since it's given that a, b, c are angles of a triangle, I can write that a plus b plus c is equal to pi. If you observe in my question, there's a by two, b by two, and c by two. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to divide this entire equation by two so that I can use the uh, given condition a bit in a better way. So this is what I would get. Uh, and I'm going to split the denominator here, like how how you see it here. A plus b by two plus c by two is nothing but equal to pi by two. Fine. I'm going to use this condition twice. You'll see uh, when the scenario will come up. Now next, let's take the LHS and get started. Okay. Let's take that. I generally like to work with A and B. Okay. I generally like to work with A and B. You could even use, you, you know, here you could use sine square. Here you could use a formula sine square A minus sine square B. It's nothing but sine of A plus into sine A minus B. So here you could start off with B and C. That's totally fine. But I like working with A and B. So what I do, so what I did is, I'm going to, uh, I want, I wanted of the form something like sine square A minus I wanted, I wanted uh, something like, you know, cos square a minus sine square b, okay. Uh, so that I can apply the formula cos of a plus b into cos of a minus b. So for that, what I'm going to do is I'm going to write this sine square a by 2 as 1 minus cos square a by 2. Why? Because sine square a is nothing more than 1 minus cos square a. Okay. Again, it's good to mention the reason like this. Uh, it will make you stand out amongst others if you mention the reasons like this. So now. So I got minus cos square a by 2 plus sine square b by 2. But I want cos square a by 2 minus sine square b by 2. What should I do? Just take minus common. So here, if I take minus common in these two terms, so this is what I get one minus of cos square a by two minus sine square b by two minus sine square c by two. It's there. Now cos square a by two minus sine square b by two. Okay. What's cos square a minus sine square b? It's a standard formula. It's nothing but cos a plus b into cos a minus b. So in case of a and b, I have a by two and b by two. So it, so it would be nothing but cos uh, a by two plus b by two and into cos a by two minus b by two. Since the denominator is same, I can you know just write it like this: a plus b by two and cos a minus b by two. Uh, this is a formula which I just used. Now next. Uh, if you remember, I just showed you, right, uh, in the beginning, like a plus b by 2 is nothing but, uh, you know, pi by 2 minus c by 2. Like if you send the c by 2 here, that's what you do. Because here I have a plus b by 2. I can write uh, in, in place of a plus b by 2 as pi by 2 minus c by 2. Right? What is cos pi by 2 minus a? It's sine a. So this would be nothing but uh, 1 minus sine c by 2. Okay. In place of a, it's sine c by 2. Like when I quote formula, I quote it generally for theta or a. And then uh, wherever, you know, whatever the variable is involved, just apply it accordingly. Fine. Now, if you'll observe in these two terms, I can take uh, minus sine C by 2 common. I can take minus sine C by 2 common. If I'll take minus sine C by 2 common, here I'd be left out with uh, cos of A minus B by 2. And here I'd be left out with plus sine C by 2. Okay, plus sine C by 2. Now, here I want to convert this uh, C by 2 to something of the form A and B, okay? In, uh, something in which A and B are the So, uh, if you remember our condition a plus b by 2 plus c by 2 is nothing but equal to pi by 2. So c by 2 is nothing but pi by 2 minus of a plus b by 2. Okay? Again, the basic condition which I told you. This is the second time which I am using this. Okay, fine. So here, uh, what is sine pi, uh, sin pi by 2 uh, minus a? This has got cos a. So in place of this, I got cos of a plus b by 2. Okay, cos of a plus b by 2. Now next, here I am going to split the denominator like a by 2 minus b by 2 and a by 2 plus b by 2. Fine. Now, this is of the form cause of a minus b plus cause of a plus b. Only the fact that there's a by 2 and b by 2. But the uh, cause of a plus b plus cause a minus b is nothing but equal to 2 cos a cos b. So, in, play, uh, in place of, you know, a and b, there's a by 2 and b by 2. So, this would be 2 cos a by 2 cos b by 2. And hence, it would be nothing but 1 minus 2 cos a by 2 cos b by 2 sin c by 2. With a little rearrangement, bring 2 to the beginning. And cos a by 2 cos b by 2 is there. And sin c by 2 is yeah, that's it. Not just this question. I mean, many more such questions uh, related to trigonometry. You can find the link to the playlist uh, in the description. Uh, if you like this video, please hit the like button. And if this is your first time coming across to my channel, please do subscribe to it.